Happy Thursday, you guys. So I'm up this morning. Actually, I'm up because, well, it's, I'm up because I'm up. God woke me up this morning and I'm thankful and grateful for that. I am blessed. We all woke up, so I'm thankful for that. So that's the reason why I'm up. But I'm up because um, they're supposed to be coming today to change our air filters and um, fire um, batteries, the, uh, not the extinguisher, but the alarm batteries. So I wanted to get up, make sure I was up early and ready for them to come, even though I do not know what time they will be here. But in the meantime, I am getting ready to bake some cookies, you guys. Um, the recipe that I made the last time, it was okay, but mm, wasn't my favorite. I felt like there's a better recipe out there. And once I really, really learned like the recipes and how the concept is of making sugar cookies, which I, it's really, really easy. But then you figure out what works for you, what you wanna incorporate to make it taste different, better, whatever. So I'm just like playing around and I know I told you guys I was gonna show you um, how I organized my little um, stuff that I got from Amazon the other day. So I'm gonna show you guys that. I have my coffee already here. And also last night I was playing with like some molds and fondant and just, you know, trying to get um, familiar with all of this stuff because this stuff, is new to me this side of baking i can bake a cake but all of this other stuff is really really new to me so um i figured that instead of baking cookies wasting cookies because uh, nobody's eating them i just figured that i took i took some parchment paper and drew out some hearts with my little uh, cookie cutter here and my battery's getting ready to die this is all the stuff I was using last night. I just cleaned it and let it air dry. But um, I just drew out some shapes and used the royal icing or the icing and just started to draw um, or pipe out with the bag onto there so I can learn how to, you know, get good at that. And then I also made some little... Um, you know, with the molds and the fondant, I made some little shapes, some crowns, butterflies, stars, all that kind of good stuff. Hearts and bows, you guys. And I did that using my little molds that I got. These are the silicone molds that I got. They're really soft and um, I don't really know if I like how these work. It seemed kind of hard unless I'm not doing something right. But anyways, you guys, um, I did try some more cookies. Here's my second batch. I feel like this one was the best. I know this is a little crooked, but I feel like I'm getting better. I feel like I'm getting better. So like I said, I'm just gonna try a whole new uh, batch this cookie here, I used regular um, sugar cookie Pillsbury Doughboy. That's why it spread and these didn't. Um, because Maya said, Mom, what if you use that? And I said, hmm, I could try. But nope, didn't work out. So that's that. I got my stuff out. And um, I'm letting my butters come to like room temperature. And yeah, um, this camera is getting ready to die. I'm gonna change this battery and then I'll show you guys the inside of my little um, organizer there. All right, so I did that. Um, yeah. Oh, so look you guys, here is their little room. After I changed everything around, I moved out the two little ones and they're in this big one here now. So there they are. And they have room for the both of their beds. What? Yeah. All right. <laughs> oh my God. So there they are. I'm gonna get you guys out in just a few minutes. Hold on. I know they're ready to get out and go outside. All right. So here's the my little bin my organizer and here's the top drawer i have to put all of my other things back so but in here i have like my edible markers 
well not edible but there you could use those what are these called they're made by wilton they're for food like you can draw you can use those to like draw on your cookies here's all the stuff i showed you guys the other day um all my little utensils and tools and everything in there and in here i put my powders and um food coloring gels all in here and this little thing that i have from the dollar tree i had this upstairs i wasn't even using it and then there's more and then i have my little ties back there i probably should get another one of these but on the side here is where i store my molds and those other two go there i need to put them back but they were drying out so that's why they're there i got me some um flavoring here these are the four flavors that i have here and uh yeah so that's how that looks right there and down in here is just like my sticks um these are like bamboo these are like shish kebab sticks but i like to use these when i'm um you know making sure things is done or for whatever reason they come in handy some little zip ties um some more sticks like cake pops or something and um these are like the bags that i use to you know put my treats in once they are done so yeah you guys um uh, this is my little sticker for my little uh cake business i had all of this stuff already before um i did this because like i said i used to do the cakes in the jars and um so yeah i just stuck one of those on there just for the sake of it you know but yeah you guys that's what's going on right now this morning i'm excited to get going with my cookies i'm just waiting for the butters to come to room temperature so that i could get going but i think i want to start um with my royal icing this morning i'm gonna color it because i'm gonna make some hearts and these cookies that i'm gonna make i am gonna use for the little event that's on saturday but i'm gonna do it today the cookies because i want to give myself some more practice and um I want the cookies to dry completely so i think it takes like eight to ten hours for the cookies to completely dry with the icing on top so if i do them today they'll be fine for saturday so that's what's going on and uh yeah babe just called me so i'm gonna give him a call back and then um start mixing like the colors playing with that today too so i'm excited about all of this little stuff because it's really giving me something to do giving me a chance to um you know keep busy and you know do something especially amari's not here so i want to take advantage of the time that i have and um just learn some stuff so that's what my summer is going to consist of learning a new craft a new hobby and hopefully um making profit off of it you know because people do well selling baked goods i know i did really well with the cake jars and i'm also going to be doing those too i'm never going to let that go but i wanted to just incorporate some new things so hey was that a lot sorry i could talk you guys so forgive me you guys look how dark it is now it started raining again this is my little working area and it got dark over here so gonna have to turn the lights on even though it is 12 20 in the afternoon but i'm starting my new recipe i got the flour inside of the um, mixer and now i'm going to start mixing this stuff up you guys pray for me because i am experimenting right now So I just added the flour to all of my wet ingredients. So now it's gonna start to thicken up into the dough. So this is almost done. And then I can start rolling them out and putting them in the oven. I already have my oven set to 350. So yeah, that's about it. But if you look at it now. I 
take it out now. But the recipe said just to let it stick to the um, to the paddle. So it looks like it's done. Now I'm gonna take it out and roll it out and then start cutting them out. So my first batch of cookies has come out of the oven. They're looking really good. And actually the dough is really good too. I like this one so much more better than the other one. And look, the sun is coming back out. So um, that part is easy. It's the piping the cookies and icing the cookies that's really hard. So, um, oh, I also made my um icing like i colored it this is actually a pink icing it kind of looks purple in here but it's actually a pink and then this one is a purple it's a lavender so those are ready those are the two colors that i'm going to use and um yeah and then like i said i think today i'm gonna start my apples you guys i feel like i'm making some progress here but i'm just so scared about the icing because these are the these are the cookies that i'm actually planning on taking for saturday and i may have to just make a lot just in case some um, trial and error you know some just don't make it out so well but anyways so far so good um the cookie dough was really easy to make and um i feel like the um it came out a lot better than the last one and um this might be it this might be my little um recipe that i'll always use when making these cookies so um if i find another recipe that sparks my attention or makes me think of hmm i want to try i may give it a try but for now it's this one so i'm happy about that and once i get good maybe i can send you guys some cookies if you guys want once i um make them so you guys can try them out and um yeah so i'm trying to keep a positive mind because i really really want these to work out and i really just want to get good at it because i've always admired cookies like baking those cookies and icing and doing all the pretty stuff so Hopefully, I'll work it all out and I'll be a master at it. You guys, they're coming out so good. I've been working on a couple of them so far. Look. I am trying really hard. I am having fun doing this. Um, it's so relaxing. I mean, until I actually have to really come through with some orders or something like that. But these are the other two that I'm working on. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with this cookie. And I have about six more cookies that I've already baked. And yeah, I just wanted to come on and show you guys what they're looking like so far. I am super happy because I think they're coming out cute. Like these are my very, very first cookies that I've done that i'm finally feeling like i'm getting the hang of it i'm slow but i'm getting the hang of it taking my time and the the piping bags are starting to feel um more comfortable in my hand so the more i do it the more i'm starting to feel comfortable and i am just so 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 happy oh i look greasy but i'm having fun so i've done those working on these and i'll show you guys um uh i'm gonna try one i have a little design here I'm going to try this and see, but I'll show you guys how I've been doing this so far.
I just did to the chair, you guys. Oh my God, working on this cookie here. My husband is gonna be so mad. I can't believe he did that. I just did that, that's insane. So I gotta get it up. All right, guys, I'm back. I took a little break from the kitchen for a while. Um, I started watching uh, Family Feud and um i baked some more cookies i was letting them cool off which it's been a while since they did cool off or i've taken them out of the oven and um this is what i have there and um these are all the ones that i made so far um i like the way it turned out i'm happy with them like i told you guys before um, so I have a couple of more that I was working on. I was letting them dry as well before I put the top coat on because I was trying a new design. I'll show you guys that one as well. But um, after this, I'm gonna call it a day because my back is starting to hurt for some reason. And um, I think I just wanna eat me something because I haven't eaten all day. I really haven't. So, and then I'm gonna um, clean up my kitchen and then call it a day. Uh, the girls are gone, Maya went to work, and Michaela went with her friend. And um, I might go to dinner with them because they asked me if I wanted to go to dinner with them. Um, well, at her friend's house. Uh, I guess they're cooking dinner at her house and she invited me over. So I haven't decided if I'm gonna go or not yet, but if the girls reach out to me, then maybe I will. But if they don't, then I won't mention it. But yeah, that's all I'm doing. I'm pretty hungry. I talked to Babe uh, a few minutes, well, maybe about 30 minutes ago. And um, yeah, I miss him already. I haven't talked to Amari today, so I'll probably give Amari a call as well and figure out what he's doing. He's enjoying his little friend. When they get together, they are just two peas in the pod. But um, I also need to make some more royal icing because I'm out. I'm not out, but I wanna make a thicker one and I'm out to make more, to make it thicker. So it's really easy. I'm gonna um, make some really fast and then I'll have some at least um, for another batch of cookies if I decide to make more later on this week. So getting ready to do that. And um, yeah, that's about it. There's the icing, it's really stiff. But you know, I, I can um, thin it out. Actually, it, it always comes out pretty stiff and then you thin it out to whatever um, consistency you want or however the thickness you want, but that's the way it starts off. So that's done. And it was um, a really easy recipe as well. This is not the same one as from the other one, but hey. Trying All right, guys, so I decided that I am going to go with the girls. I'm headed out now, so I will end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're liking these little baking videos that I'm doing because that's what I've been doing lately. So um, comment down below what you guys think, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Wonderful, babe.